Welcome back to Dust and Elysian Tail. Let's just use this resonating stone and that warp thing over here. Go back and talk to Reed. Since we died in the box, has relinquished our soul. Oh. Once I figure out what I'm doing. Uh, that one Pidget said that it's full, that it was full of cupcakes and that he was Dust was saying, Oh, it's taking over me. I thought that they were fucking with him. But apparently not. You were right, Reed. Somehow that killing blow managed to shake the presence free. <sighs> I'm back to my normal self again. I'm glad that's the case. Anyway, I was planning on using this revival stone on you if my plan didn't work, but it should still serve as an adequate reward. Wait, what do you mean if your plan didn't work? <sighs> huh. Well, it did, didn't it? So now I have no use for this revival stone, and you can take it. Hopefully, you'll never have to use it. <laughs> yes, well, you keep that box under lock and key. We're just lucky that kid down in Mudpot had the common sense not to open it. I will never let it out of my sight again. It's my burden to bear, after all. Good luck, Dust. <laughs> what else whispers to me? No. No, it can't be. The trees? The trees themselves whisper an ancient song. <laughs> Somebody must chop them all down to silence their lies. Goodbye, Reed. <sighs> I looked up into the sun today. It told me to destroy all the toothbrushes. It's just not natural. Dust, you can help me. We must stop the toothbrushes before they stop us. <laughs> no re- <laughs> What else whispers to me? Okay, trees, <laughs> toothbrushes, what else? Come on. I looked up at Okay, bye. <laughs> okay. Um Okay. Say so, finally I can do that. Yeah, I'll find those eventually. Um I'll find those as well. Eh, might as well just make it back down there. Uh, so I'll meet y'all back in Mudpot, so I'll see y'all in a bit. Hey everyone, welcome back. We're now back in Mudpot. Let's go on this way. Back into the Shrone Seromon Caverns. Hi! I thought my controller messed up for a second. Because I was moving right even though I wasn't holding any directions. So not right, left. Left, right. It's one way. Sandpaper. Oh. Um, let's see. Okay, that's 50 and 1.2 and fidgets. I'll hold off now on that. It'd make me stronger, but I think I'm good enough on strength. Just in case I need it for something else. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hey! Shop! Ah, hello again, my friend. I suspected you would return. Well, yeah. Hmm, up in there. Oh!
Um, yeah, hold off. Your trends, watch your back. I think I'm good for now. Whoa, where'd I go? Oh. Jeez. Oops. That's where that took me. Alrighty. Almost didn't make that. <laughs> this one. That bomb fruit. Okay, and yeah, let's see if it. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay, let's. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. Okay. I think I got that figured out for an air combo. <laughs> Alright, I got it figured out. I will look at it after I'm done killing these things. Ooh! Pendant in the ring. <laughs> okay. What did we get? And that's not a premise ring. Okay. 5,000. I do not have enough pipe, apparently. Poor man. Eh, not bad. I like what I got for. Uh. Whatever that is. Put in, how about no? Okay. Oh. <sighs> Looks like just crap is being shot out. Hey, sheep. In my pocket, you go. Uh, cave boogies. I am you. Your transact. Thank you. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. I mistimed when that would be shooting. Okay. Okay. 
escape buggies everywhere. No escape. Oh. Okay. Let's get out of here. Okay. Whoa! Jeez. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm supposed to go up. Figured. Well, I'll just see what's down here, anyways. <laughs> now I gotta do all these cape boogie jumps again. Oh, I'm hitting jump. Uh, probably gonna have to reset my computer after this, because apparently left of my control pad's not working and right just keeps them moving. Screw it up again, I'm just gonna edit it in. <laughs> Me getting back over there. Around. Oh, no, stop, stop! Okay. That was getting annoying. Those are the shrooms. Red moss.
Or well, maybe not. This is probably where the lady is. So let's explore the other one first. I was supposed to talk to the lady first. Let's okay. Ring of the Apprentice. Is that a lot? Okay. Quit hitting me. Or biting me. Leave me alone. Hmm. Oh. 
This must be the lady. Who are you? I am Dust, and this is Fidget. We came from mud pots seeking the one they call the Lady. And their springs have dried up, and I'm here to find out why. You would dare enter my domain and question me? Yes, the waters have stopped flowing. I was the one to stop them. Be careful, Dust. I do not believe she's used to being spoken to so casually. I meant no disrespect. Uh... I am Lady Tethys, and you will refer to me as such, with the courtesy reserved for all powerful beings of the realm. Okay, Dust, maybe you should dial it back a bit. She's getting pretty ticked off. Lady Tethys, the mud pots need your help. One of them is already close to death, but your healing waters could save his life. You, a surface dweller, would dare to question my actions. Who do you think you are, ordering me to release the waters of life? I would question the motives of any creature, deity or not, that would let their subjects perish without reason. I have felt the endless conflict as my waters ebb and flow through your land, surface dweller. I see this water satisfying the thirst of a creature much like yourself. A killer with a broken soul. A creature like me? You mean... He leads a great army across these lands, spilling innocent blood, and using my waters to give life to his campaign of hatred. I stopped the water, so I could stop the violence. But you are punishing innocents and guilty alike. Your own followers in Mudpot will die without that water. If their deaths are required to save this world, that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. You speak in petty terms. <laughs> a person, a family, a village. Their deaths, same as yours, are insignificant to the greater good. Ew. I sense a terrible danger, Dust. Prepare yourself. Yep. I have seen where your path ends, Lady Tethys, and I will not let you succumb to the same fate. Too many innocents have died already thanks to Gaius's campaign. So be it, Service Dweller. If you would raise your sword against me, then prepare to have your accursed soul ripped from your body and purged in these holy waters! Yep. Eh, well... Let's fight Lady Thesis in the next uh, episode. So thanks for joining me today. Y'all have a nice day.